This math knowledge practice test question for the ASVAB and PiCat says, what is the area of the triangle below? Again, on the ASVAB and PiCat, you're not given a reference sheet or a calculator. For that reason, you have to commit some of these basic formulas to memory, including how to calculate the area of a triangle, which is given by the formula 1 half base times height. Now, all we have to do is identify our base and our height. Our base is right here. It's going to be 10 inches. Our height's always going to be from the apex or the tallest point of the triangle straight down. Here's our apex and straight down we can see that it is going to have a height of 5 inches. So with those values identified, let's just go ahead and plug them in and solve accordingly. This becomes 1 half times 10 times 5. What is 1 half of 10? 1 half of 10 is 5, so this becomes 5 times 5. 5 times 5 is 25. So the area of this triangle is 25 square inches. Now, if you couldn't do 1 half times 10 mentally, let me do that off to the side. We have 1 half times 10. You could write 10 as a fraction by placing it over 1. 10 divided by 1 is 10. When you multiply fractions, you multiply straight across. 1 times 10 is 10. 2 times 1 is 2. 10 divided by 2 is 5. So that's how I got this 5 here mentally. You do have to know how to calculate the area of a triangle for the ASVAB and PiCat, so commit this formula to memory at some point.